I'm a mess and I will always be. Do you wanna sneak around and see me drop? Time to YouTube. It's Saturday or Monday. I don't know what. Good morning, everyone. It's the weekend. I'm pretty sure it's the weekend. We got into yeah. He did, he has no idea what day it is. Yesterday he thought. Confused. Yesterday he thought it was three Mine. different days, and none of them were the day that it actually was. That's what happens when you're traveling constantly. You don't have any regular routine or a job. <laughs> <laughs> or a job that you go to. Yeah. Uh, so yesterday, we didn't film very much because it was a bad day. <laughs> we well, got into, what? So I was going to say, we're exciting. Exc we're it exciting. was exciting. It was That's very high, exciting. It's extremely exciting. Extremely exciting. Very eventful. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we, uh, we got into Vegas last night as it was getting dark. We made a lot of rookie mistakes yesterday. <laughs> I made a lot of rookie mistakes yesterday. Yeah, you did. <laughs> uh, bad co-piloting skills. I am not good at my job yet, but um, today is a new day. <laughs> the wind was rocking the trailer, yeah. but it wasn't doing it consistently enough that it would just rock you to sleep. It was like... It would rock you and then it would shake. And, then it, and then it would stop. <laughs> And be totally still, and then I'd go to Shaky. sleep, and then it would be like, Rah! again. So, how the heck did I sleep? I only woke up a little bit. I don't know. I didn't even take any sleep aids last night. Because all you require in order to sleep is quiet a, and my, safety. And a beautiful woman by my side. Blech. Isn't that right? Yeah. Make me throw up. Mm-hmm. Anywho. We should talk about our sauce experience. Oh, yeah. Our saucy arrival to our trailer. And then after all of our rookie mistakes. And starving. Very, and very starving. One of the, the rookie mistakes was I was planning on making food the night before so we would have it while we traveled. And then I didn't. And we didn't stop for food. And we were just hungry all day and living off of rice crackers, rice cakes. <laughs> And, um, <laughs> being dumb, and then we got to where we were going to scout for our camp spot, and we opened the trailer door, and there was brown sticky stuff all <laughs> over the floor, and we realized <laughs> that this cupboard terrible. had bounced open over a ridiculous bump absolutely ridiculous bump in the road um like a huge reverse speed bump like a speed dip i think that's what they're called <laughs> okay but i don't think it was an intentional speed dip i think it was no. just a drainage dip that it was they in, did not tell us about in the freeway <laughs> going high speed and you couldn't really see it was not marked mm -hmm. so anyway huge dip bump and realized that that cupboard had come open and dropped several things onto the floor and it was sticky and it got on like two-thirds of the floor it's still some of it is still there <laughs> but he washed the whole floor i stood there freezing this and... is the freezing complaint about how the door is open well i made dinner <laughs> you did make dinner yes i made us food and we got that taken care of but it was like right at the end of our Super long, exhausting day. We were super ready to lay down and have some food. We were just frustrated. I was frustrated at myself for being dumb. And, <laughs> and I was I'm frustrated not, too. At I'm, not being dumb. <laughs> I'm not calling myself generally stupid. I'm a very intelligent person, but I did some really stupid things yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> not a dumb person you just have dumb actions <laughs> occasionally occasionally some really stupid things this is just navigating mistakes i'm not very good at it yet i will get good at it eventually <laughs> let's go look outside this is the outside this is all we've really seen of vegas so far 
beautiful Vegas. Is this a uh, desert? <laughs> ready to go gamble? Ready to go gamble right here. Where's the slot gambling. machines? Oh yeah, bright red slot machine right there. Yep. That's what that is. That's what that is. I mean, it does. It's a, it's it, a gamble every time. I mean, it does suck your money <laughs> most of the time. So that's kind of what a motorcycle oh, is. Oh, it's, it's like, really uh, bright out here. It's kind of, it's kind of like a slot machine. It just takes your money. It just keeps taking your money. <laughs> I mean, it's only taking a little bit of money so far. Well, if you take care of it, it takes your money. That's true. That's Sparkles true. is taking your money. Yes. Sparkles is also awesome and well, well cared for. Yeah. <clears throat> and much more useful. <laughs> okay, it's too bright out here. I can't. Right. Little boozer. <laughs> Don't let me run into a cactus doing something stupid like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big old grin and run fall right into a cactus. <laughs> I would too. And I just stand here and film, see how you get out. <laughs> Scream, screaming, Cody! <laughs> so what you want, honey? <laughs> I don't know what you expect from me, but this is good footage. <laughs> let me get the tripod. <laughs> be back in a couple. Are you enjoying your learning process? A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. I'm gonna make you a creative person. <laughs> Ooh. It doesn't have any spines. It has little ones. Can I touch it? No. I think that's similar to what you got last night where it was sort of like fiberglass, like really hard to get out of your fingers. I should probably get glasses. Yeah, yeah. Should we try to get to the mountains? Get to the mountains? Today? Today. I mean, you know I'm not that great at distance estimation, so I well, don't know how far those are away, really. Uh, probably about a 10 hour hike. Really? I think so, yeah. Really? Yeah. To get, like, to get to where it actually starts going up, you know, climbing substantially is probably about 8 to 10 hours, I'm thinking. Well, we better walking. start running then. Huh? <laughs> yeah. To be fair, last time that I pet a cactus, the spines were like a quarter inch long. I could definitely see them, and that was definitely stupidity on my part. What about these? Can I touch it? If you want. Can it hurt me? Yeah. Get in there. <laughs> Slap it. Slap it. No. Show who's boss. <laughs> it's definitely the boss. I really like Venus flytraps. They're so interesting how they're like, it's not mussels, but their plant version of mussels just like, yeah. onto things when it gets triggered. So interesting. See if it works. Yeah? Is that good? You gotta stand still for a second so I can get a still frame. Ow! <laughs> I told you. No. <laughs> Who's a little careless, huh? <laughs> you are. Alright, you have to tell me when I'm close enough, but not too close to touch, okay? <laughs> How says my responsibility? <laughs> I don't trust you. <laughs> Why are you trusting me over your intentions? I can't see it. <laughs> when it's too close to my face, I can't see it. Well, maybe you shouldn't put a cactus so close to your face. <laughs> it's not a cactus. It's a tree. It's a spiny okay? desert tree. Spiny desert tree. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think your mom would like this one. She would like that one. Super. Hey. Hey. Trade.
a lot better with a mixer. <laughs> I'm not sure why people choose to drink juice without any mixer. I kind of like it. Really? Yeah. Mm. I mean, if you're going to drink booze, I guess I like the separation of drink slash food slash non-alcoholic thing mm -hmm. and booze. It's so like this is booze, that is soda. There is a distinct line. <laughs> anyway, while we were deciding where we wanted to go back at the trailer, we uh, got, ended up with some neighbors and the fire marshal came by and was chatting with the neighbors and I went down to tell them that we're not abandoning our bikes, we're coming back <laughs> because we didn't take them with us to, to go get water and stuff. Uh, and the fire marshal gave us some excellent intel that we can get free water at the fire station. So we're going to do that. How did that come up? We just telling telling Josh that we were uh, watch our bikes while we were going getting water? Well, I rehearsed what I was going to say. Uh -huh. um, which was, hi, I'm your neighbor. <laughs> but he kind of ruined that because he said, hi neighbor. And then I didn't know what to say. <laughs> you, ruined. you ruined my intro. <laughs> so I was like, hi, I just wanted to let you guys know. I mean, originally it was just going to be our neighbors, but now you too, apparently, <laughs> to the fire marshal, uh, that we're just going to go fill up our trailer with water. We're not abandoning our bikes here. <laughs> and the fire marshal said, where are you going to go get water? <laughs> I was like, the KOA, we have to pay for it, but it was the only place we could find. And he's like, well, you know, there's a fire station just down the way. And I'm like, oh, can we get free water there? Apparently we can. Oh, yes. Babies. Hello. Hello. Oh my gosh, they want some snacks so badly. Yeah. You want some snacks. Oh. They get plenty of food. <laughs> oh, I'm <They're> sure. <laughs> Feed me. Feed me. Oh. Soft little noses. 